Hello and welcome back to Wildcat Chat. Now we're going to go to Baker Volleyball, a feature by Matt Quant and Kelsey Epperson. Hi, I'm Matt Quant, reporting from Collins Gym, home of the Baker Volleyball team. This past weekend, they hosted the Baker Invitational. Well, uh, this is our 10th year that we've had this. It's the Baker Invitational, and it's usually a very, very strong group of teams. We have four teams from the HAC Conference and four teams that are out of region, and we cross-pool it, so uh, none of the HAC teams have to play each other. Um, everybody plays four matches over the weekend, and it's usually a very, very strong group of teams that are here. The Cats started off Friday night with a tough matchup against Dort University of Iowa, losing in three straight games. The team bounced back later in the night in a duel against tough John Brown University out of Arkansas. After losing the first two games, Baker rallied to win three straight and seal the game. On Saturday, the Wildcats dominated the Asbury Eagles of Kentucky in three quick games. The Cats capped off the tournament with a devastating loss to Oklahoma City University in five games. The team's 2-2 two and two performance in the home tournament improved their overall record to 9-6. and six. You can catch the Cats playing next Tuesday at home against Benedictine. This has been Matt Quant with KMBU TV. Thanks, Matt. Now we're going to move on to Baldwin Bulldog football. This week they took on Paola, and here's what Coach Mike Bird had to say. I thought we controlled the line of scrimmage again. I'm really happy with our offensive and defensive lines. Uh, we showed improvement a little bit, you know, coming off the ball, sustaining our blocks a little bit better than we did last week. So that, that was a big plus for us. We always need to improve. Our special teams were not very good tonight. Our coverage team, our kickoff cover team, gave them some really good field positions. So we're going to work on that this week. And our defense, I don't think the intensity was there like it was last week. Well, we're going to get the film 7 o'clock in the morning, and then we'll you know, look at that, evaluate Prairie View, and we'll come up with a game plan you know, tomorrow afternoon. Okay, we got practice at 8 in the morning. I'll talk more then. Guys, very proud of you. Throw your uh, no huddle that we didn't do, but we're going to keep working on it. Just throw them right here. Let's get a bulldog. Yeah, baby! This week, the Baldwin Bulldogs take on Prairie View on an away game. Right after this break, though, we're going to come back with some more football.